Hey guys, I am so excited for this video that I'm going to be doing a review on what else? The Ion uh, Keratin Shampoo and Conditioner. So I am so in love with the Ion products. I have used them since I was like 16 or younger so probably like 15 16 17 years so let's get started So this is my first impression of the Ion Keratin uh, Smooth Shampoo and Conditioner. I used it one time on my hair. It is amazing. When I was in California, I went swimming a lot, so I used a family member's uh, shampoo. It um, was a Keratin Shampoo. It wasn't the same as this Ion um brand but i picked it up at sally's this ion brand and i wanted to try it out because when i was in california and i was going swimming a lot um the shampoo that i use i don't know the name of it but it moisturizes and helps grow your hair and I used it a couple of times and it was really good for my hair, especially going after swimming. So I went to Sally's and I talked to one of the girls there and she said that basically that this was the closest um, I could get to that one because I didn't know the name of it. So let's start with the Ion uh keratin shampoo first of all i learned from the girl at sally's that all ion shampoo and conditioner is color treated safe for your hair it's not going to take the color out of your hair if you have uh if you dye your hair that's what i was told by the lady at sally's so keratin is supposed is a protein um, that is in your hair that helps your hair grow um, your hair, supposedly. That's what I have learned. Don't quote me on it. But the Ion uh, Keratin Shampoo Smooth, I will just read it to you. Um, it is gentle, sulfate-free. So... A lot of like Tresemme shampoos have sulfate in them. And what sulfate is, it's basically it just the suds on your hair. Um, and you want to get a shampoo that does not have sulfate in it because I have heard. Don't call me, I heard this. Sulfate uh, shampoo and conditioner will strip your hair. Like, it is not good for your hair. And a lot of Tresemme shampoo has that in there. Um, I don't know about the colored uh, Tresemme shampoo or conditioner. I don't think it has it in there, but the shampoo does. Um it sulfate is just bad for your hair so do not get shampoo that is sulfate or has sulfate in it you want to get one like with ion or a different one that is sulfate free so um back to this um it also um it's a sulfate free formula that replaces keratin, protein, and loss uh, moisture for smoother, uh, stronger, more manageable hair. Eliminates frizz, uh, restores, uh, essentially, um, 
and helps repair breakage while blocking in uh, humidity. So it helps if you have damaged hair. And all ladies, we put um, hot tools on our hair. And over time, that is very damaging to your hair. Also, I'm not a hairstylist, I'm not an expert. I have just learned this from um, previous years of dyeing my hair. If you dye your hair blonde or you put bleach in your hair, you're actually stripping your hair of the nutrients that is in your hair and you're putting chemicals into your hair and over time or the first time that you do it could strip your hair and be very damaging to your hair because you're actually taking the color out of your hair instead of putting it back in. That's why most hairstylists tell you if you go blonde, you have to wait a while to switch it up if you want to want to dye it and go back to uh like a darker color because it is very damaging to your hair it happened to me um my hair has broke off and it took a long time these are hair extensions these took uh, like it took a long time for my hair to grow back like because I was damaging my hair, like, very badly. I was putting blonde in all the time. I wanted to do ombre. Now I have, the, now I have the ombre, sorry, the video cut off. Now I have the full ombre effect with my hair extensions. Um, so, but if you put, like, darker color into your hair, don't quote me, this has worked for me, but if you put uh like darker not blonde in your hair you're actually putting like vitamins into your hair because you're actually helping it grow that's what i have learned don't quote me on it maybe it's different for everyone but i think that this is going to be be amazing um it says uh, improves the prolong the result of the keratin smoothing treatment and is also uh safe for natural chemically treated and colored hair so that's what i just talked about so um so now on to the conditioner so now on to the keratin ion uh, keratin conditioner smooth solutions basically it says the same thing as what I read to you on the shampoo bottle because they are the same but I didn't find anything that was different um I'll just read it to you it's a nourishing uh formula replaces keratin protein and loss moisture helping hair lock uh smoother feeler stronger and more manageable so if you like sorry i almost dropped it um if you have like tangles in your hair and then if you, don't call me on it. I don't know. But if you have tangles in your hair um, or your hair is damaged, knotted, basically when you wash your hair, you um, put the conditioner on, on the ends of your hair, um, not the top of your hair like most people say. Um, it's going to make it a lot smoother when you get out of the shower to brush through it or comb through it. And you always want to use a wet 
comb if you have wet hair because if you take a regular brush or a comb and you just comb through it like you have to start at the bottom of your hair not the top because if you just go like this with the uh, regular comb or brush and you just go like that you're actually like ripping out your hair so do not do that do not quote me but that has happened to me um so yeah it basically says the same thing it says um that the conditioner helps your hair dry faster um improves and prolongs uh, the result of the keratin smoothing treatment and safe for, uh, natural chemically treated colored hair. So, this is my first impression of this. Um, it is amazing. Um, I would totally recommend it to anyone and everyone. Also, if I want to add something in there, this is not part of the keratin. I'm not trying to sell them Sally's or anything. This is what I have learned from my experience. When they say chemically treated hair, that means like if you dye your hair, but also if you have damaged hair, like because you're dyeing it, so much like if you are putting blonde into your hair a hairdresser will tell you if you go blonde and i'm not a hairdresser not a professional or anything if i have just learned this from my friends who do hair if you go blonde um over time or not over time. It could happen one time because it happened one time to me. Um, I went to somebody who thought they knew how to do ombre. And they didn't. They just got out of school. And they thought they knew what they were doing. And they didn't. Like, it turned... If I can find the picture, I'll insert it in this video. But my hair turned it was like all blonde it wasn't like it wasn't like this and this is hair extensions and it was all blonde and then she washed it and it turned purple and my hair like part of it turned purple but my hair after that was very very damaging it was very breakable and I didn't know it. And I added, like all ladies, we add heat to our hair because we want it to look pretty. So we use straighteners, curling irons, anything that has heat. And that is very damaging. And over time, it builds up and it your hair will be fried and it will break off. But... Also, I want to tell you, if you were dyeing your hair blonde, you were actually stripping the color out of your hair and you, like, you're stripping the nutrients out of your hair and you were putting chemicals into your hair. Like, I don't know if you guys knew that, but to me, when I found that out, I was like, I don't want to, I don't want to do that anymore because I used to dye my hair blonde. I used to put bleach in it. I used to ombre it a lot. And since that incident with that lady, I haven't gone back to her, but because I don't think she knew what she was doing, but that was a couple of years ago. But my hair started breaking off because she put like, dark like right after she put dark um color onto my hair so i went like you're supposed to wait when you dye your hair blonde you're supposed to wait a couple months 
to go back to dark because it's very hard on your hair and damaging to your hair. So, but that's beside the point of this video. I just wanted to put it in there. I might do a, like a video on damaged hair if you guys want because I know and I have experienced. So if you want me to do a video on it, please comment down below. All in all, like, I like this product. I've always liked Ion products. I have used them since I was about 16, I think, or 18. So quite a few years, but I love their products. And I have gotten a lot of views. I, they actually have a, a conditioner that colors your hair different colors it's called ion pigment and if you can find that on my channel i will try to link it down below but if you can try to find it um it has a lot of views i did like a neon purple one i did um how to get your hair sky blue and it's supposed to be temporary but it took me a long time guys to wash it out so if this video was very helpful to you and you enjoyed this product review please uh like this video please also don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel thanks for watching